Hey guys, welcome to the best PPSS PP emulator, best settings for R36S. Okay, and here we go. Graphic settings. So you set the mode to buffered rendering, or you can skip buffer effects for more speed. What you can also do is set frame skipping to one. And if it's laggy, set it to auto. Okay, and to prevent FPS from exceeding 60, go ahead and turn that on. Alternative speed, guys, make it unlimited. Only use this if needed, of course. And post-processing shader, guys, you can turn this off for best performance. Rendering resolution, put it at 1x. And you can increase this if your device can handle it. Hardware transform, guys, you can turn this on. Software skinning, turn it on as well. Vertex cache, make sure it's on. Lazy texture caching, make sure this one is on. R retain change textures. Toggle this one on, disable slower effects, toggle this on as well. Now, spline or vaser curves quality, make sure this one is low. And for performance tweak settings, so we have the uh, IO timing method, you can make this fast. A GPU clock speed, put it at 60 to 100, okay? You can lower this for a smoother performance, of course. And the force real clock sync, guys, turn this on for better stability. And multi-threading, guys, make sure this one is toggled on as well. Now let's go to the audio settings, okay? Make sure sound is on. Latency, keep it at zero. Audio backend, put it out auto, guys. And let's go over some other controls and other tweaks, okay? Control mapping, you can adjust this as you need it. And the disable vibration, guys, it's optional, okay? It basically saves you battery if you go and do that. And it's also optional to enable cheats. You don't have to do that if you want the authentic game experience. I'll give you some extra tips as well for better performance, guys. You can use a Vulkan backend, guys, if this is supported for smoother FPS. You can also use the original PSP resolution, basically 1x for older devices. What you can also do is close the background apps before playing. And make sure, guys, enable frame skipping for the demanding game so otherwise you should be on your way with the best settings for optimal performance i hope this guide provided value to you and if it did consider smashing that like button as well as subscribing to rapid tips and i'll see you in the next one